Alright guys, what's going on back? We're gonna go ahead and pull the level. Pull the level from I just realized who those two are. They well at least she invented the technology that allows the city to giant balloons. Quantum particles. Suspended in space-time at a fixed height. So not giant balloons? But the thing is. My book said they disappeared several years ago. I told you they'd come. No, you didn't. Right. I was going to tell you they'd come. But you didn't. But I don't. Are you sure that's right? Something tells me they're not exactly what they appear. I was going to have told you they'd come? No. The subjunctive? That's not the subjunctive. I don't think this syntax has been invented yet. It would have had to have been. Had to have had been. That can't be right. They seem to want to help. They seem to be out of their minds. Odd, isn't it? What's odd? The fact that we sometimes... Finish each other's sentences? Exactly. It would be odder if we didn't. Hmm. How do you suppose they manage that? I'll get back to you after I figure out the floating city bit. Come on. Comstock House is up ahead. Hit the butt. be getting close to shotgun kills. Man, we, oh, uh, we accidentally hit the damn button. As we just randomly make our way back up. Come on, Comstock House is up ahead. Stuck. Yeah, I think so. Why lock me up? Well, I'm guessing you didn't want to be groomed. Maybe you had something in the works to make you... Like what? I think it's best we don't find out. Anyone who 
could hear the sound of my voice. These are dire times, and I could ever so use your aid. Think you can pick this? Let me have a look. I, I hope no one has forgotten me uh, here. Got it. Uh, now back. Baby. Really don't care for the hellfire. I went out to that hall of heroes to scalp your false shepherd for you. Turns out, though, DeWitt speaks Sue. He helped me to swap words with this crippled child I've been uh, looking after. Now, after hearing how the kid has fared in your city, I'm thinking when we take your pelt, I'll let him hold the knife. Some money. Want it? Don't know Got how it. I feel with this. Elizabeth, a little help? I can do that. All yours. Decrease weapon load time by 30%.
Okay, okay. I don't know how I feel with this uh, eater gun. Just give me a normal shoddy. I like that better. Go ahead. Carbines. I guess whenever we see a carbine, we'll uh, use that. Funny enough, watch us not like find a carbine anymore. Thank <laughs> you. 
Seems easy enough. All done. The Lutes field entangled my quantum atom with waves of light, allowing for safe measurement. Sound familiar, brother? That's because you were measuring precisely the same atom from a neighboring world. We used the universe as a telegraph. Switching the field on or off became dots and dashes. Dreadfully slow. But now you and I could whisper through the wall. Can you open this? That won't take but a minute. Listen. Yeah. All yours. Kill oh, the man. Like hell. Dibs on his boots. Ha! Dibs on the girl! We need more time to look! Thanks. Thanks. Could you take a look at this lock? Let me see. Executions have a sixty five percent chance to give health. Hmm. 
I'll take the gear for now. Interesting. Brother, what Comstock failed to understand is that our contraption is a window not into prophecy, but probability. But his money means the Lutess field could become the Lutess tear. A window between worlds. A window through which you and I might finally be together. Sally! The bastard snuck in while the Vox was shooting up the place and took my girl! Got her locked up in the salty oyster. His hidden closet, he keeps all his treasures. Just need to hit the button under the register to open it, but... Bang! The dude was already dead. Man, he was up there for a while. Holy crap. This. It's a simple dual dial lock. My book said most fools keep the combination no more than 20 feet away. Let's hope we find one of those fools. This might be it. Why are you so keen on lock picking and code breaking? If you put a person in a cage, they develop an interest in such things. I suppose so. And I won't be locked up again. Elizabeth. Okay, zero four five one. Elizabeth, you promise me. I will stop him. No. That is an oath you cannot keep. But promise me that if it comes to it, you will not. Let him take me back. Oh, she kinky. It won't come to that. All right.
your alley. Back there at the shop. What you asked me to do. Let's not discuss it. No, what did that thing do to you? If you were to take me back, that's death, Mr. DeWitt. Or something so like it, I cannot tell the difference. Goodness, we're gonna go ahead and I really don't want to stop here, but Go ahead and pause here, pick back up in the next episode, and we'll see where we're at, I guess. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned.